Right, here I am next to the pond. I dip the net into the water, not too deep, or I'll just end up with a load of mud and not too near the weeds. And I make a, a figure of eight motion in the water a couple of times and then gently draw the net out of the water, bring it over to the container and turn the net upside down and gently uh, shake out the little creatures that I've caught in the net. <laughs> Here we go with another sort of pond dipping. This is a simpler sort of pond dipping. All you need is a jam jar, fasten some string around the top of it, and then you sling the jar like this into the water and then let it sink. You can either do that by dragging it through the water and let it fill up with water and then sinking, or you can half fill it with water and then throw it back in and it should sink. Now I'm bringing the jar out very carefully. Uh, make sure not to spill any water and I'm tipping the jar into my little container again. So I've been pond dipping and I've now returned with my catch and to be honest with you I've no idea what what I've caught so I'm now going to start examining the catch and what you need for this is some sort of tray. This is quite good for examining the catch.